No, no, you're not seven, uh, but. <laughs> one second, let me, no. Let me think about it. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, you're yeah, holding yeah, breath. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, but if I, even if I get myself rid of his tentacles, if I move away, he's probably gonna want to shot me again. So, if you move out of his range, I believe you can move. At least you won't be yeah, underwater but... anymore. Okay, that's a good point. Yeah, definitely. I'm going to try and escape his grapples. Okay, sounds like a good plan. <laughs> you can. Ooh. You have acrobatics? Oh, okay. All right, let's see what that makes. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, um, give me one sec. Yeah. Okay, I give you that. Um, you you're able to uh, to um, put away a lot of the tentacles around you. Something is still on your leg somehow. Somehow is still uh, able to uh, hold you a bit, but you can put your head um, over um, uh, out of the water again. So you're able to breathe in that moment. Okay. But you're not able to move away from him right now. Okay. All right. And this other nice fat watery guy is now trying to uh, do it again because it's so uh, so so great. Uh, and I think he's trying it with. Uh, let's say we're going to try it with sinister. Nope. He is not able to do that. You see a lot of tentacles coming on you, but well, no problem for you. You just you just run out of the way. Takito, what are you doing? I'm going away with magic missiles. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the sound is really awful. <laughs> okay. How do you end your turn? Sorry? First time I heard this. First time? Yeah. The thing is, Discord is really somehow killing the, the sounds of that Simonscape. I don't know why, but well, okay. It sounds like uh, a plane landed in someone's house. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a magic missile. I mean, you have a capable Takito over there. He's doing his best to help you. That's why it's, it's a little bit loud, maybe. <laughs> okay, Kawi, what are you doing? So I'm going to keep going after this uh, water weird here in front of me. Uh huh. Wish you luck with that. <clears throat> Looks good. To another 16 of them. Oh my god, you and 13 is not so bad, also. <laughs> so you see a lot of water is flowing already back into the river, and he's not, he's tiny, uh, a bit tinier than before. He's looking like that now. <laughs> That's it, I'll cut you to pieces. <laughs> and I'll end my turn. Okay. So, Monty, what are you doing? <laughs> uh, I mean, not much, I guess. Sorry. Um, uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm just um, uh, here. Yeah. Okay, I'm gi cautious. Give us a death I'm save. Messing with you. <laughs> Please give me a death save. That's the first point in dying. Okay, that's all Monty can do today, uh, or right now. Uh, Sinister, what are you doing? I'm going to try to finish off this guy. He's looking like a bit sweet now, now like, please don't, please don't. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so small. <laughs> what was that one? At 24. Yeah, you've now used uh, the, the bless on your attack. Oh, okay, that's fine. Okay. And then unarmed strike. And you killed him. Nice. nice. 
Yeah. <clears throat> so the water again flushes down the river. And you see him kind of trying to grab you with his tiny tentacles, but you're simply shaking them off, and that's no problem for you. He's then vanishing. And then I move 10, 20, and 5. Okay. So, Damon, you're going to let me drown. <laughs> <laughs> you see someone in front of uh, of that uh, other water thing. Uh, you just see the head of Vertigo uh, uh, looking out of the water. Not much more. Maybe even just the mouse, not not the not the full head. Okay. A uh, question first. Uh, this is my first time when actually people have gone down, and I'm playing a cleric. Uh, how? Uh, I have Spare the Dying, which says to stabilize a, a character that has zero help points. What yes. does that actually mean? That uh, means that in the moment when you uh, use it on Monty, he would not uh, be f uh, in the need, in the further need of uh, doing a death saving throw. He cannot die any longer. He's just lying on the ground. That's uh, He would not get any health point. That means he still is lying on the ground but um, and can't do anything, but, but he won't die. And if I use a, a healing spell on him, he'll gain the HP and then actually come out of conscious, unconscious? Exactly. And then he can stand up and be in the fight again. Okay. And Sinister blocked my spot where I was going to go to help him, so I'll have to take a little risk and go close. Ah, wait, 10 feet. Five, 10 feet. Uh, one okay. question. If he uses uh, the magic to stabilize... Uh, in that case, Monty will still have to wait the four hours until he recovers. You mean if if he uses what? <clears throat> if he uses the spell to stabilize him, not the medicine skill. Yeah. Uh, he's still going to have to wait X number of hours to come back from unconscious? Yeah, the, the point is, um, that is also a bit thing which you can discuss with your DM. I would say you're stabilized. You're absolutely still at actually zero hit points. You completely hurt all the wounds on you. You can still get ill of the wounds and things like that. So you still need uh, healing. Uh, that means uh, not only four hours will heal you. That's depending on what the DM yeah. thinks about that. It's not just four hours are over and then you can set up and do things again. It's kind of you need uh, someone caring for you uh, or even a healing spell, maybe um, um, things like that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to move and use my spare the dying ability, on Monty. Okay, just say that you use it. I I use it. That's I guess the best thing you can do because. Um, uh, that is um, not really uh, a thing you can put on him. It's simply uh, touching him and uh, and saying that you spare the dying for him. That means once you can remove um, the failure on the death saving throws and you're stable now. Come on. What, wow. I, what you I can... Said, you, see, you said you are killing me. Now you are saving me. <laughs> I can give you the stable effect even. So that's what I did. So you're not rolling. That's the idea about that effect. I, I'm not using a death saving throws automatically. But if someone of you plan to use that in future, give your PCs which are going down the stable effect so that's not um, uh, killing them by accident. <laughs> okay. So Vertigo, you've almost able to... Um, to uh, go away from Water Wild 3, but not really. He, you're not so... Perfectly in his gravel. That's because he's. Um, that's why he's trying to do that again. And now it's not just an attack. He's trying to do it by um, a bit more effort and spending a full action. And Mike's the following thing. Uh, this one is it, I guess. Give me a sec. Mm. Yeah. There you go. Now beat it. <laughs> Please roll against it. Where you go? Yeah. yeah. Oh, why? Right. Yeah. So uh, he tries to grab you uh, better than he had you before, but uh, you're able and you're managing to get your uh, foot free. And that's what he does. He's not attacking you. 
okay. I uh, look at uh, the water weird and uh, now already getting accustomed to being wet and uh, almost underwater. I uh, ready my two daggers. I mean, no, my short sword and uh, dagger and uh, I start striking at him. So you're water fighting him? Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, I, I grant you that. You're able to do that because of vertigo. Just go on. Uh, do I roll with uh, disadvantage? Uh, why should you? No. Okay. Just regular attack, please. That hurts. Okay. And with my dagger. Uh, you've not given him the damage. Oh, that was an attack roll for the first short sword. Just give him the damage for the short sword, please. <coughs> Okay. Okay. And now for the dagger. Mm -hmm. uh, you see, you cut him off uh, almost in pieces and he's shrinking like that. Not looking well. Okay. You still can move a bit if you want, Vertigo. And, um... uh, I'll slowly make my way towards <laughs> Uh, why don't give you him an? Uh, why don't give you? Uh, let him do an opportunity attack. It's no problem. <laughs> no, yeah, I, it's not I, a problem, I, man. <laughs> Nothing can happen. You're just, I'm just slowly backing away from him. I'm just wondering if you. I mean, that's the first lesson you've now learned, I guess. <laughs> okay, Takito. Honestly, I was expecting him to one hit me. So <laughs> finish him off. Hopefully, I'll finish him. I'll array frost him. I wish you luck. He's very small now. <coughs> oh, that's no problem for you. We will hit. Nice. And that's what uh, you do. He's exploding in ice shards and small pieces and uh, yeah, melting away into the river. Congratulations, you've won your first fight. That's what Wolpe suddenly says as he's uh, in the middle of the bridge right now, uh, in a second, suddenly, out of nothing. Congratulations! Well done. Um, <laughs> small parties uh, give you a bit of, of champagne, maybe. <laughs> no, just kidding. Um, a warm blanket. <laughs> a blanket? No, why? Because that's not all I have prepared for you today. I mean, it's up to you if you still if you still have um, some wits and uh, would like to go on on the right side of of that map. Uh, if not, just jump into the water and um, be off my my uh, eyes, please. <laughs> so, uh, in game terms, that means if you uh, are still up for another small thing, we can just move on and do it right now. Or if you say uh, you'd like to hit Walt in his face right now, <coughs> uh, why not? No one did that until today, I think. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I guess I go a bit away from you. <laughs> <laughs> so if you want, we can move on a bit. I've prepared a bit more. Well, I'm just prone. <laughs> I cannot move. <laughs> <laughs> ah, okay. Yeah. Uh, no one healed you, didn't <laughs> they? They just left you there where you are. <laughs> That's <laughs> nice. Oh, Jesus, survival yeah. of the fittest, bro. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he can't see that. So Wardbear is coming over to you. He's giving you all your hit points back. And um, uh, I mean, you have to stay up yourself, but you're healed. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So how do I how do I turn off the because uh, I shouldn't be raging now that the combat's over. Uh, okay, on on the combat tracker you see a small head icon. That's uh, how it looks like for me. You see that, oh. which is uh, effects. Yeah. Just open it and then um, click on the red minus. Yeah, um, and that's I guess the same with the bless. Please remove all of you guys who still have a bless on them. Please remove it. <coughs> Uh, 
Okay. Uh, how do I remove? Uh, on the right side of the combat tracker, you see a small head icon, which is, uh, if you hover over it, uh -huh. the tooltip says effects. Click on that, and then you see a minus, a red minus one uh, on the right side of the effect. Just click it and remove the effect. Uh -huh. uh, on. You see it? <clears throat> yeah, but I don't see the minus. It just says it's, it's a green on. Um, it says it's active. On the right side, uh, below the red dragon, you don't see a um, red minus. Oh, it's yeah. not a minus, a, a red icon with a with a uh, an eye, a white eye inside. Minus is on. So I have the icon with the effects. I uh -huh. click on it, and I just have a green on, and then the the effect. But on the far right side, do you have a looks like a little red line? Yeah, you in the combat tracker? <clears throat> oh. Yeah, I am on the combat tracker. Yeah, it's a red. It's actually red. Uh, if you don't find it, I just do it for you because um, I can tell you later how you how you do that maybe. Or you see it on the YouTube video when I load it up. I just. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. So everything is removed. Um, I give you one more benefit right now. So he's popping up in front of you again. You've done well, group. Nice, nice. You've survived your first fight. I give you one more thing. Um, and he's he's kind of moving his hands, looking very miraculous. And in that moment, you uh, you feel uh, long rested uh, and restoring all of your powers, uh, restoring all of your your spells again. And um, and then he's nothing uh, doing. He's not doing more. He simply uh, vanishes again. Okay. I was going to ask about that too. Yeah, just go on. Don't be so afraid. Yeah, let the healer go first. <laughs> Good job. Yeah, guys. that's always a smart one. <laughs> okay, so I think over. Monty really learns. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> okay, Monty is Monty is smart. <laughs> I, I just say stop in this moment because I'm sorry, Monty. Uh, you'd like to move your token maybe once again. <laughs> okay, you don't don't want to think. <laughs> <laughs> That's smart. I think he's not uh, he's not uh, connected anymore. Oh yeah, you're right. Monty disconnected. Hmm. Oh. Okay. So, uh more task for you. <laughs> so what you see suddenly um is that on the upper left corner you see um two nice lines sitting there and something like uh it feels a bit um, waving air or things like that on the on the wooden pole uh, on the wooden fo um, platform in the north. You see wavering air um, on top of it. You can't really figure out what that is, and you don't see it clearly right now. Please, all of you, roll initiative again. Can I do a stealth check before to try and maybe hide the, the boulders or here? <coughs> You'd like to check something? Uh, yeah, I'd like to do a stealth check to hide between the boulders here. Okay. You'd, you'd like to do it before initiative, that's what, what I understood, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're absolutely not visible for anyone. <laughs> no, sorry, <laughs> that was an awful throw. No, not really awful, but... Um, Okay. I I will roll for the NPCs um, also uh, if they are able to see you or not. Um, but uh, give me that thing. Um, the thing is, um, you're quite sure that. Um, these lines are very smart. Smart. The eyes are focusing you like, um, like um, someone who has a bit brain in in, uh, in the head. And um, also, you'd like to uh, vanish from the picture vertigo. You're sure that um, the lion still can see you. That's what you feel in in your blood. <laughs> okay. 
Takita was really very, very fast, so you first. Okay, perfect. Sinister, you're not wearing any armor, right? Negative, don't wear armor. Okay, I'll start with the uh, magic armor for Sinister. <laughs> okay, what a caring type of... Yeah. And there's a visit you are. Did you give it to him? Yeah, you give him the effect, right? Okay, not wonderful. <clears throat> okay, so this guy um, is running on you. Um, let me see if he can does it, do that. Yes, it's 45. So what he does is he's really sprinting like hell and jumps directly on you, Kari, um, <clears throat> and tries to hit you uh, with his claw while jumping on you in the same moment. <clears throat> yeah, okay. That doesn't sound fun. No. <laughs> Come here, kitty! <laughs> and that's what he does. He's really coming on you and slashes you with his claw and then sits on you and tries to drop you prone onto the ground but is not able to. You're like a wall. <laughs> not bad. So, yeah, you're kind of, uh, your breast muscles are like a, like a wall. Uh, his head just plumps against you and nothing happens with you. He's standing like a wall. Okay. Sinister, but nevertheless hurt hurt you a lot. So I move twenty five to here, and then I attack the lion. Okay, such a nice. Oh, oh I forgot to control. Yeah, no problem. Um, yeah. You've attacked <clears throat> this one, right? Let's see if you hit. You hit. Okay, and then I do the unarmed strike, and then the additional martial, <clears throat> and that would be my turn. Wonderful. Uh, for, the, for the additional thing, you have to roll uh, an attack again. <clears throat> if the seven I hit. Did, did you do I that? Five, yeah, I added a five and a seven. Uh, yeah, that's the damage. You see what I mean? Oh, I mean you, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, for yeah, the cool. seven damage, you have to uh, please uh, try to hit him again, and then you get yes. seven damage on him. Ah, okay. awful! <laughs> that means line number two is uh, more healthier than before. Okay. Ah, sorry for that. Oh, no. Okay. All right. Sinister, you still can move. Um, I'll give you one more information, uh, which could make a move interesting. Uh, what I'm doing in play here is uh, also, and many use that. That's an optional rule, but I think it gives you a bit of more strategy, tactics, whatever. Uh, I'm applying uh, the flanking rule also. I'm applying the flanking rule also for my game. That means if you are flanking an opponent with at least one ally, you get advantage. Both of you get that. And flanking in my games means that you have to be on the opposite uh, opposite side uh, of uh, the opponent as your ally would be. That means for you, Sinister, if you move up here, uh, Kari would get an advantage on his attacks and you get also advantage on your attacks then. If not, an, uh, a second opponent would uh, disturb you. Okay? Okay, I got it. Thank you. All right. So if you want to move up there, just do it. Otherwise, Vertigo, you next. Okay. Uh, I'm going to nimbly climb over the rocks here, ready my crossbow, and uh, shoot at the lion. Mm -hmm. <coughs> That's a poor lion. Crossbows, barbarians, like a wall. <laughs> <laughs> but you're not... And I miss. <laughs> no, it's a very big lion. I totally miss it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. 
then please end your turn and carry you would be next. And you can still move vertical if you want. Um, so am I from where I'm at, am I going to have advantage now because sinister yes, or sinister? Yes, Exactly. Death? Yeah. Okay. I would say so, sinister, uh, just sorry, um be very precise. I put you in here because that would be exactly if that's okay for you. Okay, yes, that's yeah. Fine. All right, so then you have advantage now. Okay, so I am uh yeah, I'm going to enter a rage and I'm going to swing with my great sword. Um, yeah, being hit with the lion can give you rage, so that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, barely. Okay. <laughs> uh huh. But you hit him. Did hit him. That's, yeah. that's the important thing. Okay, that was weird. Had the dice and then they just dissolved. Yeah, I'm tell me if you. There we go. Oh, that was. I. You get an effect plus two. What that? Yeah, because of. Ah, uh, because of the rage. Yeah, sure. Okay, so you see that in the. Uh, the damage counter. You see that it counted in the plus two damage you make because of rage. Yes. Okay. Go Anything on, else? Kitty. Yeah. <laughs> You see that advantage uh, uh, might be useful. Okay. Um, anything else you'd like to do, Kerry? Uh, no, I will end my turn. Although there's my button. Okay. okay. So what happens next is before Lion One goes into run and he's running on you, um, you see the wavering air on the pull on the on the on the platform vanishing and um uh, give me a sec i don't want to cheat you of course okay i i want to cheat you but <laughs> <laughs> yeah the wearing a vanishing and um i would say vertigo please Give me a um, perception. And Takito, you also can give me a perception roll. Okay. It's a skill, right? As you probably know. That's fine. For some reason, my character sheet isn't open. Ah, okay. Uh, no problem. I'm just waiting for you. On the skill tab, please just click on the perception roll or roll it in the chat. Okay, so um, Takito, you're the only one seeing um, the waving air over here where I give you the pointer. It somehow popped away from the platform and suddenly popped in right in front of you again. That's not good. Mm -hmm. And now the lion comes running. Uh, I like lions because they're so fast. And he runs up here. And tries the same nice thing with you. Tries to hit you with his claw. <coughs> what he does. And now it jumps on you. And this time, he actually brings you down. You're right in front of a very brutal looking lion. He's, he really likes to eat you and you're lying in front of him on the ground and waiting for his bite. So Damon, what are you doing? Okay, let's see. I'm going to... Target line number two with gilding bolt. Mm -hmm. Shit, not double click. Okay, the first one is single click. Yes. Yeah, the first one is a hit, so the second two. Okay. And damage. Hey, my God! You already killed him. What did you do to my poor lion? <laughs> I threw a bolt of light at him. 
<laughs> yeah, so um, this ball of light is striking with uh, uh, a lot. He's going down. Wonderful shot, Damon. And I'm going to move to give better advantage here. Okay, good idea. I'll end my turn. Mm -hmm. Oh, you already did my turn. Yeah, sorry. Um, and Monty, uh, maybe you're coming back. That's why I leave you in here, but um, well, let's see. Okay, Takita, what are you doing? 